Be one of the busiest Thanksgiving holiday travel weeks ever, whether you're on the roads or headed to the airport. An ABC Action News reporter Eric Waxler joins us live at Tampa International Airport with what you need to know before you travel. Eric? Wendy, if you're coming here to the airport, keep an eye out on delays. You know how weather issues elsewhere can have that domino effect and have something uh, negative to affect your flight. But however you're traveling this holiday week, it's always best to leave early. When you're about to travel with three kids, you better be prepared. The Badawi family is headed to the airport for a flight to New York City, and it's easy to see these kids are excited. I want to go to the Legoland and the Nickelodeon Mall, and also I want to go um, snowboarding. It's probably the busiest time of year to travel. Um, you know, with that said, I did book a direct flight and I'm going to get there on time. Getting to the airport early is always a good idea, but leaving early on your road trip is important too. That's because AAA says almost 3 million people in Florida will be traveling 50 miles or more for Thanksgiving. That's the most in almost 20 years. Gas prices in Florida are averaging about $3.55 a gallon. That's 20 cents more than last year at this time. But AAA says travel spending is at its highest level since before the pandemic. Oftentimes when gas prices are high, people look for other ways to offset the added expense, whether that be spending a little less on shopping and dining out or maybe even staying in a less expensive hotel. AAA says the busiest times on Florida's roads will be Wednesday from 11 to 8 and Friday through Sunday late afternoon to early evening. Leave early if you can. If you can hit the road at like 8 a.m. or so, that's ideal. If you can't and you're looking at the afternoon or so, you want to avoid the congestion, it's probably better to leave in the later evening hours. Air travel numbers are up about 7% from last year, according to AAA. Returning to pre-pandemic numbers, despite the higher cost of so many things associated with traveling. But for this family, it's worth it. You travel once or twice a year, so I want the kids to experience New York in a fun way. Yeah, and I think they are going to have some fun looking at the boards. So far, so good. Most of the flights look like they are on time. And if you are hitting the road, make sure your car is in proper working order, especially get your tires properly inflated. You don't want any surprises on your Thanksgiving holiday travel. Live at Tampa International Airport, I'm Eric Waxler, ABC Action News.